Finding the parallel major or minor key is easy. Simply take the letter name of a song or progression's original key and then flip it to major or minor. For example, the parallel minor of a progression in A is A minor, and the parallel major of A minor is A. In the realm of music theory, it doesn't get much easier than that. Here's a progression in the key of A minor that borrows the five chord from the parallel major key of A major. One, two, three, four. <laughs> The major 5, E, resolves much more strongly to the A minor chord than the minor 5, E minor. And you can hear the difference if you substitute an E minor for the E major chord in this progression and compare how the two resolve to A minor. And here's how the E sounds going to A minor. Artists like the Beatles sometimes took this a step further by borrowing two chords from the parallel major. Our next example switches the A minor at the end to an A major chord, similar to how the Beatles played I'll Be Back. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Swapping between major 1 and minor 1 chords is less common than using the major 5 in a minor context, but it's another cool trick to have in your bag.